this is just going to be a few tips of where I get my wallpapers. Um, some people ask, and I don't mind giving them the link, but uh, it's just easier just to show them where I get them because um, they, they're all pretty good, the wallpapers I get. Um, I make sure they fit my monitor perfect, and I think they look pretty sweet. So, um, so there's just a few tips. Um, one thing you can do is find the sites um, you normally go to, and you can subscribe to them, and you'll get new wallpapers every day here in your uh, Google Reader, and you can see they come up. Um, for an example here, you can use Desktop Nexus, and it'll bring you to the wallpaper. You can enlarge it, and you can, sometimes it'll automatically detect your size, but sometimes you have to do this. Uh, step here and as you can see it detects your resolution so I have a 1440 by 900 so you can just go to continue and it'll make the full size and you can see it looks pretty sweet um, so I can save it to my wallpapers right in here and yeah then I can go add it in afterwards so that's one way you can use Google Reader after you find the sites and subscribe to them and you can see they come in pretty often like there's like I think tons of them come in like every hour because you can see I can't even go down all the way and it's like still from one hour ago there's tons of them in here so that's pretty good and the next way what I do is um, if you know your uh, resolution of your screen just type that in followed by wallpaper or wallpapers and you can see Google will give you tons of results here all matching 1440 by 900 um, so we'll just choose one like this one right here Let's save it see how it looks can add it in See, it looks pretty sweet. <laughs> I don't even know what it is, but <laughs> um, so that's one way to do it. Just search um, for wallpapers in Google, and some of them might be kind of crappy. There's not too many good ones here, but there's there's some all right ones. Um, the only reason why I say use your resolution because you don't want to just search like wallpaper because chances are it's not going to fit your resolution, and you don't want it to be blurry. Uh, you want it to be the exact size, so. Um, that's one way. Another way is you can just search widescreen wallpapers if you have a widescreen monitor uh, like me and it'll take you to a few different sites like this one right here. Uh, you can see, I like this site in particular because you can just click on one like right here <laughs> um, and you can see you got a bunch of choices down here for your, your monitor and open it up and I might as well save this while I'm here. <laughs> change it right now see how that looks wallpapers I don't know where the hell it is oh I don't know where it is right now <laughs> wait oh here it is So that looks pretty sweet. Fits my size, and uh, yeah. So I'll probably keep that there for a while. Um, so that's uh, one way. And the last way is if you don't want to go searching for individual ones, I say search for a torrent. Um, you can see, whoops, see here. Just search off uh, your size and wallpaper torrent, and you usually get packages of them. Of um, I don't know how many's in here. Um, try another one. This one you get 40. 40 paintings, 1440 by 900. And if you feel comfortable downloading the torrent, do that. Um, why not? I don't see wallpaper. Why wallpaper should be illegal with torrents? Um, I don't even know if they are. I just I don't usually use torrents, but if I want to get some good wallpapers, I will. And you can open it up. It'll come in a zip file. Just extract it after. And yeah. 
So that's just how I get a few of my wallpapers. Um, so, yeah, that's it.